how's everyone hope you have a beautiful wednesday so i wanted to do a quick reading just so for the meow meow kitty cat intuition the best advice the best message for you today from the universe the best message for you today from spirit guides or from um, for whichever time you're going to gravitate on uh, this reading in whichever stage in your life you know you can look at this reading one year from now or anytime the universe wanting to give you a message so what is the answer to your question or what is the best advice for you today but i'm going to use my meow meow kitty cat intuition so let's let's make this uh reading short quick and and fun as well but as the same time truthful and honest okay because i'm not going to be here without spirit guides and guardian angel so we can try um more deeper reading next time so chai because i'm just going to use one two three four four energies today four decks tarot and oracle combination and meow meow kitty cat intuition and as you can see there's three choices right in front of you and you can pick your choices the lamp from aladdin rub the lamp if you're wanting the genie to come out and make your three wishes come true the bow mirror mirror on the wall who's the prettiest of them all that no matter what okay all the challenges that's coming your way all the bad juju even if they're trying to throw you into the forest there's always a way okay there is magic there is the company of the seven dwarves is going to protect you and be your friend be your companion and going to to be your strong community it's like guardian angel and spirit guides to be with you to help you through in your journey and cinderella that sometimes you're going to be or not only sometimes maybe you're going through in your life right now that you're feeling like where do i go from here i'm feeling so hopeless and you're looking up in the stars is magic really do exist are you going to get out of this rock bottom will your dreams come true and the universe is trying to say yes the the hills is you're going to have the magic slippers and you're the only one who's going to have the key <laughs> to wear these magic slippers and magic shoe to have your emperor and no one else okay no no one else is going to take your true love from you and no one going to take the blessings from you because you are the one and true empress or emperor okay so pick your choices anyway let's go i'll give you a moment calling on my spirit guides my guardian angel the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages possible energies advice for pile lamp bow and heels spirit guides the best message for us today, the best meow meow kitty cat intuition for today to guide us through today or this week. Thank you very much. Let's go. So I hope you made your choices and I really just want to do this quick reading until we can get back on the groove again by tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And I'm going to use our meow meow kitty cat in Intuition, meow meow scoop of the day. Let's go. I swear, guys, the answer to the question if something is bothering the mind of pile one, what is this love, career, self love journey? I am ready. Thank you very much. Let's go. What is bothering pile one? Best message for pile one today six of cups. Six of cups, something is bothering you from the past. Or you are manifesting a reunion or you are trying to seek knowledge from the past okay so anyway maybe you're worried about a child or there's an inner child inside you who is crying so regardless regardless spirit guys trying to say 
something is bothering you from the past something you need to heal from the past past life trauma past life karma let's understand six of cups could also mean someone from your past coming back in your life or maybe you are connecting with someone you need to share memories with or maybe you are reminiscing what you did wrong what did you learn in this journey or you're learning your life lessons so let's understand look oh my god it's a beautiful kitty let's understand so tribe so maybe you are worried about the child or you are worried about that inner child inside you wanting to wanting to be happy so let's understand what is worrying you pam this is a flyer right here knight of pentacles see what is bothering you you need to be patient because you're hungry now where's my food now give me my food now give me my true love now i want to marry now or where's my job where's my money because i'm hungry i don't have anything and i feel so alone but universe trying to tell you pile one be patient you are a work in progress. Be patient, child. I can't give you your food yet if it's not cooked yet. And you know what? Your true love can come in your life yet if if they are toxic. So what's your choice? You don't want this person to come in and come out of your life and then leave you anyway. So you need this person to come in in your life if you are manifesting true love. Okay? Um, to not give you any baggage drama heartache heartbreak and not going to make you cry if this is all about the job patience you have to apply for a job okay you cannot be manifesting and praying for a job and you don't try to apply a job i kind of know that there's kind of like manual labor is the same as aladdin trying to embrace the quest to look for the genie and the lamp after all after all spirit guy says embrace the journey okay then that's how you're going to um understand what the universe is trying to make you see okay regardless there is a door opening before you it's an opportunity i know you can see it right now because you know what you want it now let go of control issues okay so anyway patience child patience child sit there i know you're hungry but it won't be long okay sit and make sure you sit on the chair and then you're not going to fall off the chair do not be falling off on the path because now if nothing was happening you feel angry with god and the universe why your prayers it's not being heard why your wishes is not coming true let's understand more thank you five of wands okay choose your battles wisely there's competition maybe you're feeling like you have to compete for your true love for your blessings to come in your life or um you know what spirit guys is also trying to say you don't compete on anyone but you only compete with yourself you never uh, want to seek validation from others because if you're going to constantly seek validation from others why they have this and you don't have that why they're already married and you're still there so anyway what's wrong with you no spirit guide says you're going to uh, be your own you're going to focus on your own thing okay you're going to focus on yourself do not be you know nothing is what it seems anyway maybe you think other are blessed more blessed than you but anyway spirit guy says you're going to open your path for magical things and magical blessings to come true if you're going through a hard, hard time and challenges right now because it feels like look you're you're feeling like you're always last into everything you're feeling out of place anyway because it feels like you know it feels like good luck is already there and then suddenly something happens again so it's like you don't understand this but pick your battles wisely that is the best message for you today remove yourself from controlling people loud people aggressive people manipulative people or remove yourself from dark energies toxic energies because this is what's making you stuck right now remember you have to embrace the path and spirit guide says you have to be patient child so what now the lovers yes i do believe you are manifesting your twin flame union
divine union you are manifesting true love and commitment is there someone out there who is going to love you does he love me does she love me do they love me like what's their intention towards me why do i have to win your attention why can't you just see me so anyway this is a message that you have a have you have a hard time manifesting true love marriage and commitment in your life but the lovers is look it's the sun shining there's divine guidance but also the lovers means someone needs to choose you someone needs to see you someone needs to not break their promise to you because right now maybe this is a part of your frustration okay like what did you do wrong how can you clear the karma? Remember, your first underlying energy is six of cups. It's all about like, do not commit the same mistake as you did in the past. If you want your blessing, if you want your true love, or if you want your healing, then, Spirit Guy says, first of all, you must, you must uh, know that you are a work in progress. Five of sword, five, five, five. Maybe you are seeing five, 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 or you're going to see five, five, five. Look, five of wands. Pick your battles wisely. Five of swords is also like, why? You don't need competition. Five of swords is something is holding you back from your blessing. It's toxic energy. Okay, like, like look, I, I feel like there's conflict. There's misunderstandings. You're feeling like, Filling out a place or a fish out of water. So if you cannot blend in the crowd, why are you going to force yourself in a certain connection or certain situation? If that's not the right job for you, then the right not the right relationship, then be patient, child. Because look, the universe is trying to tell you it's not the right relationship, it's not the right time, it's not the right connection. Simply be, you know universe knows best remember oh my god but 555 also means embrace the journey embrace the changes you might be going through emotional time right now but you gotta learn to trust and you don't want to be vibrating to people who doesn't have the best intention towards you people that is not true loyal honest at the end of it all if you want your blessing you have to gravitate to the right community the right spirit guys the right soul tribe, the right job. Okay, so anyway, what else do you need to hear today? This is how I understand right now. And look, someone's back is turned. Maybe someone has left you. Let them, okay? Because if universe is trying to tell you that's not the right job, not the right connection, not the right situation right now, you're going to find a way out how to get out of this mess okay because right now you're feeling stuck someone is blocking you king of swords i tell you king of swords if this is your divine masculine well they have to fight for you they have to be they know they have to know the truth because if someone is trying to backstab you and talk bad about you then whoever you're connecting to cannot be listening to this bad juju this dark attacks okay or dark dark backstabbings against you so anyway i know my truth something or i know i know who you are i know you better you're not like that or i need to protect you from all this bad voodoo or bad attacks or dark attacks okay so anyway king of swords is also someone who is loyal honest and true or maybe spirit guy says if you've been if you were in a toxic relationship before and then you know what maybe it's time okay to manifest someone who needs to be honest and true and loyal to you or maybe someone has hurt you from before pile one but it's a message from the universe that this person is going to grow up especially if you are manifesting a twin flame connection okay Maybe this is also a message that, yes, I recognize you now. I know that I have hurt you. I know that, yeah, there's some bad decision, but I choose you now. And I'm going to grow. I'm going to evolve. Or simply be it's a message that there is a solution to your problem. Okay? But be careful who you trust. 
and spirit guide says maybe you're quite guarded right now or you're connecting with someone who's quite guarded but regardless there is truth okay and um it feels like universe wants you to vibrate to walk a path where there's no conflict where there is only truth so i don't know i hope it answers your question because that's how i can see right now i miss all this pile here pile lamp stay true to yourself because that's going to help you manifest your desires and your dreams so anyway what else helpful people i tell you helpful community i already did i was saying that yes vibrate with the right community to help you manifest the dreams of your heart okay you're like if it's a dream about true love a dream about a dream job the right job the right community so simply be right now pile one i know that you're feeling stuck so now you have to ask help from others ask help from spirit guides in the divine to get you through this okay so anyway within the next few months so you'll start a new job you'll find a way how to get out of this mess okay how to get out of the rock bottom or within the next few months you'll meet someone or you're you're going to communicate with someone who has hurt you maybe someone is going to tell you hi hello anyway you might soul tribe someone who knows their truth whether you already know this person or someone in your life okay remain positive okay so anything could have come out but spirit guy says you cannot be a negative thinker this is your best advice right now patience pile one and remain positive and if you are not feeling well and you're feeling like hopeless ask help from others ask help from guardian angels and be patient because within the next few months it's going to get better and sorry so child i have to stretch as usual because if your kitty cat is in the floor and now i have to go back to yoga but now i have i still have to heal my toe it's always something you know so anyway yeah i was walking our mascot yesterday and i was also limping so thank you let's go keep the vigil justice will triumph good will always prevail over evil and look this is also a person like the king of swords knight of swords energy i know i will follow the signs i will follow my heart i will choose you my love if this is all about you like manifesting and calling your future spouse your next relationship your twin flame okay so anyway i think you're something is bothering you pile one if something is bothering you like something about love someone is going to fight for you because there's the sword someone who knows the truth and someone is going to offer you the purest love the purest intention but it's saying justice will triumph so it means it means he believes you. I mean, I'm saying he or they, but this is a male energy, a masculine energy. It's a message from your true love. I believe you. I will fight for you. I already told you that. Okay, so anyway. See, move away from difficult situation. What did I tell you? Pam. I thought you're not going to hear me say Pam. See, patience, child. Whoever you're waiting for right now, this could be your twin flame. This could be your true love. They are currently going through their transformation, their or transition, or they're trying to move away from things that doesn't serve them anymore, so they can come to you with purest intention. They can come with you. They can come to your life with true love and the truth okay and what do you have to do right now you have to heal yourself heal your inner child and bring back confidence in yourself and most of all if the dark forces the fear uncertainty and confusion is making you hopeless right now remember you are in the 555 energy the darker fights remember stay away from conflict move away from a difficult situation move away from things uh, that doesn't have the best intention towards you this is the reason why i'm already trying to tell you that especially if you are a divine feminine or especially if you are a female who picked pile one whoever you're waiting for the truth good news 
your true love or blessings eventually they're going to come your way within the next few months okay so you need to be patient that's why i was already seeing oh patience child do not worry okay so anyway can i just get one please spirit guys thank you very much prosperity better times ahead the opportunity the door the, the universe is going to open door for you pile one you know prosperity also means abundance so that could also mean by next year by 2022 you'll feel a lot more confident and you'll feel a lot better when it comes to love money and your life purpose okay but regardless you're going to embrace the journey okay you're going to walk this path you're going to walk this bridge you're not going to get stuck okay so prepare i i captain you are the captain of your own destiny so in order for you to to embrace adventure or to like win a conquest or something or a win a quest well you have to embrace the journey you have to fight the battle okay but until then yes you're going through battles right now and a lot trying to bring you down but spirit guy says you have help that's why you're going to ask help from the divine from the universe and regardless you are supported thank you so i believe even let's say you are truly in a twin flame journey i think you're having a hard time because you're encountering blocks right now with people who doesn't get you who just wants you out of the picture but regardless someone's going to choose you i already told you that but let's go move forward let's set, let's set aside pile one let's see what your energy is pile mirror mirror on the wall who is the fairest of them all who gravitate to snow eye let's understand <laughs> will the seven dwarfs be your friend or be your angels to help you through in this journey so let's understand i know they will be but you know what's the mes best message for you today what are you going through pile two two of swords you're going through dark night of the soul tower moment confusion but you must choose now you are not blinded and you are not going to just get stuck there in the dark like where do you go from here is this someone going to come in your life or you know where do you go from here because you don't know you are confused this is confusion this is someone in the crossroad look the meow meow kitty is like help i don't feel good here please help okay you're asking help from god okay or you're asking help to god to like you know you are trying to ask help for direction you are trying to ask help because you hit rock bottom maybe you don't have a job you don't have a love life you're not feeling well so let's understand someone threw you in the forest okay because the evil stepmother do not want you to be there so anyway i understand that there could be some dark forces dark attacks bad dreams okay so remember remember spirit guy says You have to choose you have to choose light every time you can never be in the dark place and get stuck there because you know what the light will always oh my god but uh, but if you're there in the dark spirit guys guardian angel my question is if you if they are in the dark okay it's easy to say walk towards the light but what if it's so dark and we can never really see the light maybe spirit guy says the light is already in your heart okay the little light in your heart is going to manifest into hope and it's going to attract more guardian angels and then suddenly out of this darkness bam, guardian angels you're going to see the glowing wings in the distance and remember kitty cat is here guardian angels is here spirit guys is, is here so technically you're not alone especially if you are my collective you know nothing is perfect but i truly tell you that you know we're going to find you wherever you are okay in your most darkest even if you're 
they're already kind of troll sometimes like kitty cat but we're going to find you okay you're not going to be lost and alone and be afraid in the dark that's how our mission to each other okay i tell you the tower moment did i tell you did i stutter no you're going through a very dark time you're feeling powerless uncertain hopeless and you're crying and you're in pain and you're going through personal struggle and you're possibly currently have a hard time manifesting your true love your marriage because now you know you also have to be healthy you also need to worry about yourself and your family and your community and then now the money is not so good and also like there's a lot of chaos there's a lot of drama that's happening right now i get it i already told you that you are in a crossroad you're going through dark night of the soul but it's the fear it's the darkness who is trying to hold you back from walking from taking the path then do not let anything stop you from walking the path remember even if you cannot see the light right now follow my voice follow follow your heart or follow like even if you're feeling hopeless right now see this is what why am i here okay do not like i said do not be judging me sometimes i could be too much but at the end of it all who's going to push through is guardian angels and spirit guys if i am your vessel okay if i'm your divine messenger right now and i'm trying to tell you you're not stuck there take a take a leap of faith or take a step forward it could be painful right now but take one step at a time i'm trying to tell you if you cannot see anything if it's dark and if if i can have like you know, the opportunity if universe give us the opportunity that you can follow my voice called kitty cat there i am here with you okay guardian guardian angels here with you so it's, i'm just making an expression okay queen of swords see you have to be a fighter do not lower your standards someone has hurt you toxic relationship you you're not you know contented with a job maybe you don't have a job right now but the spirit guy says you you know or maybe someone did not treat you right but regardless spirit guy says you know deep in your heart that you are noble okay even if you have to apply for a job right now even if a job that you do not like but you have to pay bills anyway remember we have to adjust and be flexible here in the treaty so so chime you don't have to have a lot of crown and jewels and not have a lot of money in the bank to say that you are regal that you are royal the true royal and the true regal is how the way you carry yourself how you face the community you know so try because you're graceful you are elegant unless if you were born uh, the like uh, you know with royal blood flowing into your veins but so try we are all regal especially here in my collective remember you are the empress deserving of your emperor you deserve stability because right now spirit guide says you need healing like deep emotional healing and you need to not like you know do not settle for less okay because queen of swords you could be very single right now okay but you have to be fierce and do not be scared sometimes to be vulnerable but at the same time you're not going to be a doormat because spirit guys is also trying to teach you your problems as a solution okay if there is darkness if there's something holding you back in here whether there's no love life no money uncertainty and you're feeling bored right now remember be a warrior that's how the queen of swords is you're not going to settle for less see what i'm trying to tell you so anyway let's understand more i love this okay if you're feeling a certain you don't feel well hang in there okay do not let the darkness uh, get over you okay the darkness wants you to feel bad so you can like stop taking care of you so you they can stop you from manifesting your blessings of true love and the right career they really want to mess with your mind okay so now you need clarity okay so let's understand strength what did i tell you strength you're going to be my Mahal, I am a warrior. Bring it on. 
because I am strong. But Juju, you're not going to tell me that I am nobody. I am the Empress Queen. I am the Emperor King. You're not going to come in my territory and tie me down in the dark. I'm going to be mouth, mouth, mouth. You're going to feel my teeth, my claw, and my mouth, mouth strength. Okay, so anyway, see? It's coming together. Um, this is because that's how the universe wanting to tell you the best message today. You have to hang on. Buckle your seatbelt and enjoy the ride and be strong for their life. Strength could also be in, do not give up on love. Do not give up on marriage. You have to be brave. You need courage to win this fight okay so if you are not feeling well right now if you're feeling sick mentally emotionally spiritually what do you have to do regain back your strength okay and you know what to do so anyway but first of all say your prayers then because your greatest weapon right now as your strength and your shield is god up above and your miracle worker nine of pentacles see nine of pentacles shadow work the dreams that you seek even if it's so far away you feel like ah oh, you want this bird now universe says no you can have that bird because you know what there's a little birdie there but you're going to be you're going to go after your dreams anyway but you make sure that's the right dream. You're not going to hurt anyone because you are going to be a better version of yourself. You're going to be friends with this bird, okay? Instead of like, you know what? Anyway, Spirit Guide says you're going to be a better version of you. But regardless, you will be... You... You... The universe will have your back. The universe will provide. The God will provide you what you need. As long as you embrace the path. As long as you, like, you know what? Heal yourself. Take care of you. Anyway, that's how I understand right now. But, you know what? But you... But, look. You, you need your company. You don't want to be, like, hurting this little birdie. Okay? <laughs> Say bird you want some banana you want some food okay so anyway tweet 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 okay but anyway yeah also could be a message like do not be comparing yourself to others as well if you are in social media a lot nothing is what it seems okay because tweet 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 it's like you're waiting for goodness but the goodness is in the cage right now so i don't know let's understand okay let's let's understand do not seek validation from likes subscribers so if you're like always in social media, take a break on it. So anyway, I don't know why I'm saying that. Maybe you're watching someone in social media. So take it easy. Focus on yourself. Focus on your healing for now. Take a break. Seven of Swords. Yes, I tell you. Spirit Guide says there's some dark underlying energy. You don't want to be manifesting deceptive energy around you. First of all, you know, we're not going to be pinpointing or anyone that they're toxic, they're lying, they're deceptive or something like that. First, we must check on ourselves. Like, you know, first of all, what do you want on, on yourself? Are you being true to yourself or are you trying to pretend who you're not? Remember, universe wants you to be original. Remember, universe wants you to be authentic. If you are manifesting a true love or a love interest you can never pretend who you're not okay you can only try to let you know enhance your beauty enhance your quality enhance your beautiful traits but you're not going to be pretending someone you cannot okay so spirit guys maintain spirit guys trying to tell you the best the best message for you today pile Pile to maintain your authenticity okay once in a while it's so easy to judge others once in a while you get deviated from focusing on yourself but right now 
for now i think universe says you have to choose peace you have to choose you you have to choose yourself and stay strong for dear life because you are trying to ask help from god up above to hear your prayer to hear your plea for help okay so anyway three of pentacles see you need the right community to get you out of this mess because if you are fearful okay and you're biting and frustra frustrated and feeling bored in there like you have no job no love you don't feel well see there's an arrow you need divine guidance you need the right community the right soul tribe the right or you need the guidance of jesus christ holy spirit oh my gosh so try to get out of this box spirit guide says get out of your comfort zone because it's time for you to manifest and explore new opportunities in your life page of cups why is the kitty on the ball you are curious so explore your options open yourself for opportunities to come in your life whether this is could be a new job a new love or blessings or a new friendship maybe you're going to have a secret admirer and you know what spirit guy says maybe you are you need to be curious and you need to just keep it open okay do not close your mind your heart from anything anyway we're not going to burn bridges but for now, Spirit Guy says, maybe you'll have a secret admirer. <laughs> See? Oh my God. Your secret admirer is, you know what? Enjoy little things in life right now. Okay? So, regardless, you know, Spirit Guy says, whoever is going to come in your life, they also have work to do. Okay? After all, they're still on the page of Cups energy. But regardless, this is a new and fresh energy. Step out of your comfort zone. Do not be fearful. Universe going to bring to bring fresh energy, fresh blessings in your life, or fresh community to help you choose. So let's understand. Get more information. Get to know people. Get to know. If the, if the job you're applying for, is this the right job for you? So get more information, research, educate, and you need guidance, okay? So anyway, get more information. This also means that the Tree of Pentacles energy or Eight of Pentacles energy. You need to develop skills, new hobbies, interests. Do not be stuck and then... There you are, depressed and hopeless and stressed. So anyway, enjoy your enjoy life. Do things that you love. Even it could be hard. But Spirit Guy says, do not, do not forget yourself. Remember, your best message right now is your healing, your self-love journey. So you can manifest blessings to come in your life. Helpful people, what did I tell you? You need the seven dwarfs. You need guardian angel. You need soul tribe to help you through. And also, you need the guidance of God up above. Look, the Holy Trinity, Father, Son, the Holy Spirit, to protect you. I think you need protection, Pile 2, because you've been going through a lot of darkness, tower moment, uncertainty. So right now, I think if you have to pray for something, you have to pray for protection, for peace, for healing for uh, divine guidance okay no need to worry well this is guardian angel michael and all the angels and saints in heaven trying to say you've been true a lot you're worried you don't have money you're worried how do you go from here you're worried like um is there someone to love you like you are just so fearful and sad and lonely and you're going through these frustrating times but the universe is trying to say you cannot be manifesting beautiful energies beautiful blessings if you're all always constantly worrying i know it's so easy not to to say i know it's not you know, so tribe, I know it's so easy to say, do not worry, do not worry. But, you know, I truly feel your pain because I've been there. we all been there. It's the darkness, the uncertainty, it's the gloom and doom that just went like a 
bewitching evil spell okay but i tell you universe universe trying to say you have guides you have help from up above but you have to ascend as well and you have to call the right guides okay you have to pray to the father the son the holy spirit to help you get out of this very dark mess this crossroad because you need god to help you i'm just trying to tell you that in my own kitty cat intuition okay see getting out of the tower moment but first do not be over worrying there like are you like making the right steps I think you're over analyzing you're over worrying but for now take one step at a time remember you're not really alone i tell you bring peace to troubled waters the emergence of celtic white tara see it's the six of source energy and the cherry blossoms means like you're going through a phase of metamorphosis or transformation. Remember, cherry blossoms only blooms two weeks in a year. I love it. But look, you have to purify yourself. Cleanse yourself away from things that doesn't serve you anymore. Could be toxic places, toxic connection, toxic connection. And you're going through troubled times. But universe trying to tell you, child, we are here. It's you know you're not going to be stuck in the dark we are here we are going to give you reinforcement and help to bring peaceful times in your life trust and surrender okay so anyway maybe this is also you divine feminine or female energy you're going to travel when I say travel, that doesn't only mean physical travel, but it could also mean you're going to get out of the dark night of the soul. You're going to move past the treaty. So you're going to ascend, okay? On your spiritual journey, you're going to ascend to 4D, 5D, 6D, 7D, but you also have to learn how to ground yourself. So I know you're going to your own... Uh, struggles right now how to understand this path how to manifest blessings but universe truly trying to tell you your best advice right now trust and surrender and remain brave courageous and strong and determined run wild for a while wolf child and know that there's an inner warrior goddess an inner warrior god inside you okay but first you must you must heal okay you must find your right wolf pack you must find your yeah it's like your right soul tribe your right spiritual guide and, and it's kind of like a superhero you need to to gather your strength first and then when you are ready when you are well and trained and then you're going to get back out there okay fight your battle but remember spirit guide says child recharge your energies you need healing right now it's no sense like like you know fighting a battle if you're not well yet if you don't have the right confidence and if you are in the dark you do not want to be manifesting more problem and putting yourself more on a deep web of craziness and madness especially a lot is happening right now so anyway that's how i understand in your journey from the very get-go of your reading pile one is all about healing yourself focusing on yourself and learning to trust to listen to the universe when they're trying to tell you we're going to get you help okay we're going to help you we're going to be here we never even left you we're always here but you know what it's just the dark forces trying to stop you or maybe the universe is trying to say we're not giving you tests and challenges that you cannot win this is just your quest so you can gather your strength you can learn how to fight a million battles and come out winning and slay your demons yes because you're the empress maybe you are seeing three 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 you are beautiful no one is going to put you in the corner pile two 
no one's going to put you in the corner and say yeah you're nobody you cannot be manifesting love you don't deserve love you are not beautiful forget them they're shallow okay remember universe taught me here okay how to turn pain into power how to turn pain into strength that's why you gotta learn to trust to embrace your ascension because that's your only way right now to power manifest your dreams your desires and stay on the right path remember empress energy the universe are going to bless you with intuition the universe going to have your back to provide what you need or what you want in this lifetime it could be money it could be community it could be self-confidence it could be true love it could be divine union it could be marriage maybe you want to be I don't know. Um, empress also means maybe you want to have a child, you want to have a pet. Regardless, so tribe, you know, the way I'm see and I, the way that I understand the empress is like, you know, your power manifester and whatever you're going to manifest in your life, you're going to have it. That's it. You always get what you want. But at the same time, you're graceful, you're elegant, you're a good person. So anything else that is in your way, of course, you're going to be in your warrior mode and beast mode. So anything else, either they're going to be your ally or they're going to be blocking you from your path. But regardless, you're going to be the one winning. Thank you very much. So stay in there. Spirit Guide says, you went through a lot, pal, too. You're going through some things right now that you think it's so unbelievable that you cannot get out of, but you will get out of it. Remember, we're already supernatural. So thank you. I try and stay there. Hang in there. Okay, you'll be all right. Thank you. Let's go pile. Pile. Cinderella. Pile. Heels. Let's see what the Meow Meow Kit Kat intuition for you today. What are you going to? Thank you. Spirit guys for pile three, please. The moon. Trust your intuition. Some things you still do not know, but there might be a special message for you on the incoming full moon. This could also mean that you're going through emotional time, sensitive time. You're feeling like, oh my God, one morning you just wake up and suddenly you feel like crying. You don't know what you are feeling right now. So you might be someone who's also gravitate to the energy of the moon. You need to cleanse yourself. You're very gifted. You are, um, you know, you could be clairaudient, clairvoyant, something. Okay. So anyway, spirit guy says you're very intuitive. Um, you're also possibly an introvert and you want peace and quiet. But right now, you know what? You were kind of feeling hopeless because you were trying to pray for something and dreaming and manifesting for something for quite a while. But universe trying to say, it's okay, child. Okay? You know, universe has a lot of surprises for you. Good surprises anyway. But you have to be, you have to learn this journey one step at a time. If universe says, okay, wait and and keep going one step at a time. It's a glimmer of hope, glimmer of light. It's like illumination in your path. It's the same as your spiritual journey. You know, maybe you are seeing signs, symbols, synchronicities, and then you're frustrated because you do not know what this sign means, but you possibly are drawn to someone. Okay, if this is a twin flame connection, like why? You know in your heart there's this deep connection right there and you are, you know, confused if truly they are your twin flame. But if you already know that you're in a twin flame connection, then this is a confirmation that you have to trust your intuition and listen to your intuition. Your intuition is right. Universe sending you 1111 or angel numbers clarifying that yes, you're in a twin flame path. Or simply, if your question is, where do you go from here when it comes to job, when it comes to your life purpose, when it comes to your love life? Universe has still a lot of, like, they're working behind the scenes to give you the blessing, okay? But right now, you're going through challenges, that's okay. You have to trust that universe has your back. See, Ace of Swords. <laughs> you might not like it how the universe teaches teaches you sometimes how the universe take care of you sometimes but in order to be the greatest warrior you have to undergo some pain and some sorrow and some struggle but it won't be long do not cut my fingernails do not <laughs> 
that hurt me because sometimes you're thinking like oh, these tests and challenges has hurt you well you know what we have we are going to own our little scars and nicks and whatever in there like you know what no pain no gain but spirit guide says you're going to recover out of this madness out of this darkness you will come out stronger okay so universe is truly trying to teach you right now to um to to fight for your dreams that's it so ace of swords could mean you might be connecting with someone who also needs to be in the right vibration who also needs to be honest loyal and true to you okay so let's see it could be this could be a connection between water sign pisces cancer scorpio or libra gemini aquarius i don't know but i was feeling it so i just have to say it. so seven of pentacles do not give up on your dreams your hard work will pay off <laughs> spend your money wisely or make sure that if you're going to plant a garden or you're going to to take and take care of a garden or a plant make sure you water it but do not over water or under water it so anyway regardless spirit guide says you need to work hard on your dreams and look eventually your jar is going to be full of coins or eventually whatever you're planting and working on is eventually going to flower and blossom do not worry child do not worry pile tree if money can be tight right now remember you have to keep looking for a job you have to be a hustler you know not a bad hustler but you need to hustle and grind and knit and grit okay remember we're kind of like going through desperate times right now so spirit guy says you might not like how the universe teaches you right now. You might be not liking where the universe push you right now. Whether this is the, you know, like maybe universe push you in a job that you don't like. But regardless, Perry Guy says you're going to find a way how to make things work for you. So you can save money. So you can be much more stronger. So you can find more opportunity to come in your life. Remember, there's still a lot of surprises. Okay? You know, surprises, challenges, but something, something, okay? But something that, uh, that you can conquer. Something that, you know what? You're going to use this challenges to as your fuel to be much more stronger okay so anyway what now five of wands okay so there's no competition or if some if you feel like yeah someone has someone is jealous about you or someone backstabbing you or is the dark forces trying to put more tests and challenges in your path i was already talking about challenges spirit guys is trying to say these challenges are just a test they're not blocks because these are challenges and tests that you can pass okay that you can have an a plus one plus like you can you can pass with flying colors okay so anyway this is how i can see right now do not let anything stop you from manifesting your goals your dreams your dream job your true love to come in your life there is a way there is a way god will always find a way or we will find a way a soul tribe we will find a way out of this mess okay knight of pentacles and you need to stay strong and you need to stay patient if you are manifesting the right job for you the right true love oh my god you're like wanting it like now where's my true love i want you now to be in my life i want my right job that pays well the race and promotion but why universe why you put me here why now i'm single and have no money and then now spirit guy says stop procrastinating stop complaining you just have to be patient and do what do the best you can okay remember we are trying to manifest and trying to find a path right now how to um like you know how to get the best opportunities in our life i mean there's blocks right now we just went through madness to 
the last few years. But anyway, universe trying to say you're a work in progress. You're get you're going to get out of this mess. The uncertainty, the fear, the dark night of the soul, you know, the separation, no no love life, no money, um, not feeling well, cannot sleep, okay? So anyway, beware of the dark attacks, beware of the bad juju, beware of the dark forces manifesting fear in your life. This is the least you're going to be worrying right now. Remember, we are aware that universe is going to is giving you tests and challenges but tests and challenges that's only going to make you stronger okay so do not be uh fearful okay i might remember as the greatest warrior you gotta undergo training you have to have you know you, the the universe is going to to train you so you can fight for yourself you can be like you know alert okay like your defenses your something okay maybe it's, it's, it's also a message that the universe is trying to build you okay or to like transform your dna or something or give you like the right guidance okay so you can win a million battles okay so anyway i don't know what to say nine of one see i tell you universe is trying to give you the ammo the strength and the determination that no matter what comes in your way you're going to be like oh my god you're going to like not tangle all this but you're not going to get anything or anyone be in your way okay because you are going to be focused after all nine of ones it's like if someone is like blocking your path you're going to pick up your stick your shield your sword and you're going to come out fighting you're going to slay your fears you're going to slay your demons so spirit guys is trying to say even if right now you are not seeing something like seeing the love of your life or the wishes coming true or something in your life right now that you're so not contented it's just tests and challenges be determined uh learn perseverance and you're going to get out of this okay or you're going to make the best out of any crazy situation so anyway nine of pentacles 999 you're just going through a phase right now no love life some things you do not like decisions that you don't want to do but 999 you're going to focus on yourself you're going to focus on your healing and 999 means you're going through a phase and a stage in your life it's like a cocoon okay you're being there but you're just going to Develop your wings in there and when it's time, when it's ready, universe say it's time for a new cycle, child. It's time for a new beginning and that's how you need to be. Right now you are, it's very important for you to heal yourself, okay? Because that's how I can understand in your journey right now. If you encountered a lot of no, do not cry, okay? Because remember, universe do not want you to be crying and complaining. Universe wants you to stay strong, okay? And find the yes out of the no. See, listen to your intuition. What did I tell you? Pam! Kid cut back in business already. Listen to your intuition. Trust your intuition. Universe loves you, pile tree. You are not being left there alone. Your dreams can come true. There is fairy godmother, fairy kitty cat mother in here trying to tell you. We are here with you, child. And you're also very gifted. So if you are someone who is very much confused how to listen to your intuition, remember, universe been giving you signs. You might be connecting with someone who is a twin flame, who is a love interest, who is a future spouse. If you are drawn to that person, then something. There's a deep connection there. And if you're feeling hopeless, well, spirit guide says don't feel hopeless because right, right now you're in the, your beast mode okay wait what did i tell you gotta wait okay because you have to be patient and brave and wait child and because you want now 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 why you put me here no love life no money no nothing why universe why god no okay you have to say okay universe okay god up above i trust and i'm going to wait for the right person the right connection the right job 
but you're not going to be waiting there and doing nothing you're going to work on yourself you're going to heal yourself and you're going to make the best of any situation i already told you that okay if you believe because magic and opportunities and blessings is going to manifest in your path in the form of a person in the form of a dream job in the form of money in the form of good health okay so remember magic only happens to those who believe that's why i keep saying True love, happily ever after, magic, whatever. Of course, we're going to um, stay on that a year from now. There you go. Spirit guys says, your life is going to be better a year from now. So stay strong in there. There is a time frame. Maybe sometime next year, you'll be much more better, much more confident. You'll start a new job somewhere. Or if not, maybe a true love, new love, or potential love interest or a serious relationship is finally going to manifest in your life embody ancient wisdom merlin awaits this is also about magic you are ready the the path is ready before you you're going to manifest your own happily ever after you're going to make the the best out of any situation you're go not going to take no for an answer you are being guided by the universe but you're going to be careful of people who doesn't um uh, you know who doesn't have the best intention towards you be careful of people who doesn't speak the truth okay so anyway that's how i could see right now be careful of backstabbers anyway i don't know why i'm trying be careful who you trust that's how because if you are manifesting wonderful things right now you have to pray directly to god up above that's all i can tell you or if this is a potential future spouse they have to make the way okay they have to also clear the blocks the fork in the road they also need to fight for you so they can manifest in front of you and tell you i'm not going anywhere i'll be with you through good times and bad times so explore other options see spirit guys trying to decide you know this is um male energy maybe they are also a work in progress maybe you are someone who is feeling impatient right now where's your true love where's your next relationship they are a work in progress they are on your way to you and they're going to bring you these branches of leaves which means peace and harmony actually they're going to bring you fruits and flowers and jewelry and hopefully going to bring you ring as well and there's also a dove and freedom Ho hopefully this person also going to bring you healing okay maybe if this you connecting with someone who has hurt you maybe this is a reunion reconciliation energy someone from your past life okay but anyway the way you understand there is someone coming in your life a true love okay going to bring you peace healing flowers and love okay trying to say not going anywhere i will be supportive of you yeah become your own sovereign because you're on your you are going to be listening to your intuition and trusting the signs and trusting the universe that universe will provide for you become your own sovereign that means you're going to be your own power manifestor you're going to manifest your dreams to control control you have the control you have the power to control your own destiny you drive your own spaceship okay so anyway embrace the journey and you might have to check pile one pile three sorry i have to stretch because i was already cramping but anyway i don't know um your energy is kind of sort of similar to pile one so check pile lamp as well maybe you cannot decide whether you're going to to choose pile heels pile cinderella or pile one aladdin or jasmine so regardless see the sun is going to shine in your life it's the most powerful yes <laughs> it's marriage it's happiness it's your pursuit to happiness it's big wedding a happy life a happy love life a happy career and the sun could also be your life purpose also your um 
mission to heal others. Maybe right now, Pile 3, you're on a specific mission and the universe is trying to bring you there. So there's some things that you cannot understand right now. We might not understand right now. It's the same as me. I'm your supernatural channeler. Seriously, so tribe, have mercy on Kitty Cat. I don't even understand this. I might see everything. I'm already channeling. I'm ready to tell you what we can see. And how many million bombs I'm going to tell you, so child, at the end of it all, after this reading, I'm going to look up to God. And I really, truly need my grounding. And I truly need to meditate and heal my toes. Because we need to be in good shape. Okay, we need to be in good health. We also need to be strong mentally, physically, emotionally, whatever. So I'm just trying to say at the end of it all, so child, even if I could see every oracle, every tarot that I am going to channel right in front of you, whether it's live, it's recorded or anything. I don't know. At the end of it all, it's not really like I'm being catty, feisty. We know, so tribe, at the beginning of my journey, I've always been humble anyway, but I'm always just feisty and catty. And sometimes maybe others do not understand that. But at the end of it all, I need that spunk. I need that feistiness so we can cross the bridge of the supernatural because without my spunk and feistiness, so child, we're not going to even make it on that bridge. But kitty cats possibly like, you know, quick and feisty and spunk, you know, and ah, pam! I made it across the veil, behind the bell, and now I got that gift now because remember in order to get to that bell you have to be quick you have to like be spunky and you know bam! but you know i have the best spirit guides too so thank you spirit guides guardian angel thank you it's an honor to be with you in our journey so tribe how are you going to do this how are you going to get the the best and the best and the best warrior angels best spirit guides we are blessed my collective no, even if you are going through like bad health and craziness right now, I know you're going to heal. I know you're going to transform. I know you have to suffer for a little bit, but the universe will always find a way. Remember, we have the maker, the creator and God on our side He's always in charge. The evil, the bad things, they're not going to win. They're going to think that they're victorious for a time, but it's only for a time. And then suddenly, bam, we're going to spread our wings and say, who are you putting in the corner? No, thank you. You're the bad juju and we are with the light. So who are you? Who are you trying to trample them? No. Okay, see, Spirit Guide says you are a child of light. You are a child of God. And you will always choose to walk as a child of the light, as a child of God. That's what I mean. And as a child of God, you deserve to be happy. You deserve to be loved. You deserve to manifest your dreams and your wishes to come true. And stay there. Okay, it's easy to really deviate from this path. Especially sometimes you could be too judgmental of kitty cat or sometimes, you know, we are just a little channel. But however little the channel, we are small but terrible, okay? Incredible, phenomenal, magical. I'm just, I just have to really say that because we have the best universe. We have the best spaceship or at least, you know, the best warriors and guides to help us during this journey. Thank you, Soul Tribe. This is it for now. Have a good day and we'll try again tomorrow, tomorrow and the next day. I love you and stay there. Stay strong and hope this message will give you the light and answers that you seek for today or tomorrow or this week. Okay? After all, we're always learning. After all, Kitika always trying. Okay? But Kitika always need to also be in the best energy so child you cannot be locking kitty cat here on the table in front of the tarot kitty cat is a busy woman as well so thank you i love you all be blessed we try again love you all bye say your prayers so try bye